to expedite removal of the Trende Aragua and other savage gangs, I will invoke the Alien Enemies Act of 1798. Can you imagine? Those were the old days when they had tough politicians. I have to go back that long. Think of that, 1798. Oh, it's a powerful act. You couldn't pass something like that today. Today, we're politically correct. Today, people kill and they end up getting out on bail in two minutes. No, this is a little different act. The Aliens Enemy Act, 1798, to target and dismantle every migrant criminal network operating on American soil. 100%. And in honor of the great people of Aurora, Colorado, we will call this Operation Aurora, because they were the first to suffer with this group of thugs. And if they come back into our country after removal, it's an automatic 10 years in jail with no possibility of parole. No possibility. Not that we the fact that people are still calling Project 2025 fear-mongering when Trump literally said that he would invoke the Alien Sedition Act of 1798, you might want to be concerned because if you have anybody that you love that isn't as pink and pale as I am, they're at risk. Do you not remember the Japanese-American internment camps of World War II, Japanese-Americans who were born in the United States of America were forced against their will to spend their time in concentration camps around the United States of America, hundreds and sometimes thousands of miles away from their home. Have you ever visited one of those sites? I have myself. I have been to Manzanar myself in California on several occasions, and I took my children so that they could see what history is so that history will not repeat itself. I have a family friend whose family is Japanese-American and spent their time in one of those concentration camps. So to all of the white people who are saying that Project 2025 is just fear-mongering, do better. It's fucking real. We literally have history to show it.